Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday I let you know that Microsoft had rolled out the latest optional bug fix C release update for Windows 11 version 24H2, which is KB5065789. Now I'll leave the video linked uh, for what it's worth. But as you can see, if you have a look just above that, the same update has rolled out for Windows 11 25H2, which I updated to this morning, and Microsoft started rolling that out officially late yesterday on the 30th of September in my region. And I've posted a whole video on the official release, what you need to know and how to roll back. I'll leave that link down below in the end screen with this update video. Now, because Windows 11 25H2 is based on top of Windows 11 24H2, the same update, as you can see, 5065789 has rolled out for both versions of Windows 11 because 25H2 is built on top of 24H2. And here's the video I posted on that yesterday. It was 15 minutes long, so I'm not going to rehash all of that. I'll leave this linked because it had 17 new features. Hardware indicators can be moved on your screen for volume, brightness, and so on. And a whole lot more. It was a big update. So I'm just making you aware that if you do upgrade to 25H2, you are going to get the same update re-downloaded and installed, as in my case. Now, as you can see, once you have updated, instead of it being 26,100, the build, like it is on 24H2, that will be bumped up to 26,200.6725, which is the build. 26,200 is the build for 25H2, as I've mentioned previously on the channel. Now, although the update is exactly the same, there is one fix that Microsoft has included that wasn't with the original 24H2 update. And it's a fix for Hyper-V with Microsoft saying that when you assign a GPU para virtualization device to a VM, the session may freeze and stop responding. So if you are using virtual machines, that's quite an important fix. Fixed Hyper-V. So that's the only fix Microsoft has included for both versions that wasn't there when I posted yesterday. So just making you guys aware of it, go check the video out. It will be linked. Lots going on. And that update now is rolled out for both versions, 24H2 and 25H2. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.